Hi friends and welcome to my cozy night in, night routine. I did some research. There's really no one that I can find that is 50 plus that shares their nighttime routine. Yes, they'll share their skincare routine, that kind of thing. But as far as what they do at night, you know, maybe making a little dinner, just a relaxing, cozy night. Now, there's a lot of people that are around our age that are now empty nesters, or maybe you're single and you live alone. And I just want you all to know that you really deserve a wonderful, lovely, pampered night. And uh, you need to take time out for yourself. I think it is just so important. I really take time to uh, relax, reset, and just basically, it's my me time and I really truly enjoy it. Now Mark's away on a golf trip, so we're really gonna enjoy a cozy night together and I just wanna say welcome. And I hope you walk away from this video with a lot of great tips. This is one of my most favorite times of the evening and it's 5.15. Now of course, as the days start to get longer, this time will change a little bit, but I like to put on my flameless candles. I like to light a candle and just start to relax and wind down. I just lit a candle, the fireplace. I got some jazz music playing, and of course, I got that beautiful screensaver in the background. So now I'm gonna make something really delicious for dinner. This is something Mark would never eat, so I'm really excited to try this recipe. And actually, it's called spaghetti squash pizza. I'm really excited to make this. I think it's gonna be delicious. It's not gonna be too heavy. It's gonna be just perfect for tonight. While the spaghetti squash is in the oven cooking, I'm gonna go ahead and get my loungers on so I can get nice and cozy and comfy. I watch you as you drive. Do you know I'm looking? And I can't help but smile. Do you know how much I love you? You put my favorite song on I put my feet up And we just sing along And I can't help but feeling Just loving this moment Can we stay here forever? I'm loving this moment Can we stay here together? If I could stop the time Don't you know that I would, cause I'm just loving this moment 
most favorite times of the night and it's taking off my makeup and I do do it without the bathroom lights on I like to have either a candle or a lamp you guys know how much I love the coziness I hate overhead lighting I literally do not like it okay especially at night because I just want to start getting my body ready for sleep so we're gonna go ahead and pull my head back my head back my hair back if you see coloring here, it's because I just got my hair colored. Okay, so we're gonna take off my eye makeup first with Bioderma.
Next, I'm gonna use my Neutrogena Face Bite. I really do a lot of steps here when it comes to cleansing my face because it's just so important to get all that stuff, all the foundation, concealer, blush, all that stuff off your face. Okay, so next I like my Tula Facial Cleanser. I'm gonna go ahead and get the water nice and warm. Oh, one thing. Most important, I love to put these on when I'm washing my face, just so the water does not run down and make my well, right now my lounge just put soon my jammies all wet, so I should have actually put this on first. So here they are. I love these. So we're gonna go ahead and get this all emulsified. And then one of my mom's sweet, sweet friends made me these washcloths. And uh, anyway, she knitted them. And if you watch Melissa 55, you all know how much she loves these. And she's someone I adore and I love watching. And uh, anyway, this is what she uses. And again, getting all that stuff off your face. All right, face is nice and clean. I'm gonna let it dry off here for a second. And the next thing we're gonna go ahead and do is we're going to add, oh, this feels so good. <laughs> and then, this is something new I've been using. This is by O'Hendrix, and this is a nighttime serum. So the next thing I'm gonna add, and this is a Clinique, and this is Moisture Surge. I do not like a heavy moisturizer, and I have got normal skin, I just don't like heavy moisturizers, and I do like this by Clinique. I just love how it feels, I like it, does, I, especially I do this day and night, and it does not make my makeup at all. You know how sometimes if you have thick moisturizer, your makeup just does not go on well. And then I got this a while back from Rose Ink, and this is their eye cream. And I really like this stuff a lot. Just a little bit goes a long way. All right, so that is it for my skincare. Okay, so after I brush my teeth, I do love, and I've been talking about this for years, I love to use the Sarah Hap Lip Slip. I love to wear matte lipstick, liquid lipstick, and this keeps my lips so hydrated, I don't ever have to worry about them feeling dry and chapped. So this is the best. So this is the last thing that I put on. And I'm gonna wait and put this on until after I have some tea because I have some more things I wanna share with you. things that 
that I enjoy doing in the evenings. Normally there are certain things that I like to do in my morning routine, but of course there's some mornings where you get up and you're out the door. But on the perfect day, I do like to do my Bible study, um, my daily devotions, and things like that in the morning. But at nighttime is when I really enjoy doing my affirmations. And I also like to do uh, my, what I call brain dumping and just things that I want to do for the next day and maybe just some added extra prayers or whatever happened throughout the day, things that are on my mind. Um, I just like to spend some time, um, quiet time praying. And some of the things I do like to do are the new me in 2023. I shared this before with Heather Baxter. And I just go back in this book and I look at my life wheel and uh, those different things that I'm praying for uh, different intentions and things like that. Um, also, we're just starting a new Bible study, The Anointed Me, so working on that as well. Um, but this is just where I like to take some quiet time. The TV is off, I have my tea, and just really just enjoying the quietness with the fire going or a candle uh, and um, just time with me and Lord and that is just probably um, to me it's the most important time of the day and again I like to do this also as well in the morning but I like to end my night doing this too and um, also I do I do have an app on my Apple watch that also tracks my sleep at night and um, I really I find it very interesting to wake up in the morning to find out how my sleep was and I love what it says, congratulations, you achieved your goal, uh, which is a great thing. Uh, I have been taking melatonin at night and it's been a huge, a huge help. And also I've been taking magnesium during the day and all that combined has just been fabulous for me. Um, but I really hope that you enjoyed uh, my nightly routine. Uh, like I said, I normally every night this is what I do, even if Mark is home, He's normally, you know, watching some kind of sports or a documentary and I'm editing and then I'll go into the room and start my skincare and stuff like that uh, while he is taking out Archie and shutting everything down uh, for the night. But I really enjoy just spending my quiet evening uh, with you, Archie and I, and I just can't thank you enough. I hope that you enjoy this video. If you want to see more videos like this please just let me know um, but I hope that maybe you've got some ideas and the biggest thing I want all of you to know is that you deserve time to yourself it is so important and I want you to treat yourself like the beautiful woman that you are and, uh, and even the men that are watching tonight uh, and just uh, take time for you really it's so important and just relax and uh, just you know thank God for all the gifts and be grateful and uh, just take time to pray and I just think if you do all these things together it just really just helps have you have a great sleep but also in the morning set you out for a great day so I want you all to know that I love you so much thank you more than I can say for taking time out of your day for, uh, or your evening whenever you're watching this uh, just to take time out to hang out with me. I love you guys and I'll see you next time. I'm going to blow out my candles, turn on my lights, and I'm going to go to bed. Good night.